I want your opinion. Uh, what do you think about uh, the Donovan Mitchell rumors uh, from the Knicks? So Donovan Mitchell is a similar uh, trade situation to Kevin Durant being that he is on the same team that Rudy Gobert was traded from, and they believe Donovan Mitchell to be better than Rudy Gobert as well. So their price is higher than that price. The Knicks are a perfect trade partner, being that they have more draft picks to trade than any team really in the league. There's a couple teams that have similar war chests from Oklahoma City who gave the Knicks three picks on draft night to New Orleans, et cetera. But of the teams that are actually in on Donovan Mitchell, the teams that have checked in that from I've, what I've heard have been Washington, uh, Charlotte, Toronto, Miami, and New York. Miami's kind of the, the only team along with Toronto that's really in on both Donovan and Kevin Durant. Um, but no, none of those teams can match the Knicks' overall draft asset pool. And the Jazz, unlike Brooklyn, that you know the Nets want to try to get back players and pieces that can help them compete now. The Jazz are more focused by all accounts on, on young players and draft picks. So really, all of a sudden, the fact that New York now has three extra picks to, to play with here, um, they, they really are at the front of the line to get Donovan Mitchell. But Utah is not going to trade him unless any team meets their exorbitant asking price. So it's kind of that's why we're at a standstill here. People are, you know, it's a staring contest and people are waiting to see whose bluff is going to get called. But, man, I, I hope see in soon. The new movie from Spider-Man, Spider-Man 4, <laughs> okay? My, oh, the new Miles Morales <laughs> coming to the Knicks, Spider-Man 4. <laughs> <laughs> ah, man, I believe, I still, still believe 